Hey guys, it's me again, and I am going on part two of my tutorial. As you can see um, on the last video, I had um, glued these three pieces, and I just love how this one looks. That looks just super cool. And then, um, like I said, look, you guys, even just with a little bit of glue, it all stayed together, and it's a lot easier to put stuff together after that. Now, when I make a, I'm going to make a, a flower tutorial. Cindy Lou, who made a, a rose with metals, I cut mine a little different and made my own design. But um, go ahead, check her out. She does a lot of th things with metal. And I, I will be making a, a flower tutorial with uh, lace and with metal flowers as well. But I just wanted to sh quick show you how I'm going to embellish them. Um, like I said, I made these and I just pretty much just cut them, bend them, and fold them. That's really all it is. And once you start feeling comfortable cutting these metals and layering them, um, you'll be, believe me, you'll be doing a lot more. So on that first one that I've made, I'm just going to go ahead and glue this flower on. And then I also use the Dimensional Magic to glue on the rhinestones. And I'll show you that right now as well. I bought this gem picker. It's just like this at um jewel pick jewel picker it's called at Hobby Lobby. I think I paid like three bucks for this. And all it is is this like tacky. Look at that. It picks them up real easy. Just gotta make sure that you keep a, a cover on this because if it gets dirty, then it won't pick them up and all you do is run a little bit of water and clean it right up and, and it picks stuff up again. There it is. So all I'm really going to be doing is picking out some spots where I want the stones to be. The nice thing about the dimensional magic is that it takes so long to dry that you could just put... um. I'm going to put this here so I can show you guys how I'm picking it up. So you can just put a bunch of um, dots. The only thing you have to be careful is, and it doesn't matter if the if the, the dimensional magic gets over your stones because it, it will dry shiny and it won't, um, it, it won't look bad. See, now here I just dropped my jewel and then I put this on the... Dimensional magic, but then all you do is rub it back off. Now these, I they're called jelly rhinestones, and I picked them up on eBay. The more you buy, I think when I looked them up, I looked at a thousand of them. I bought a big a bag of a thousand, and it's cheaper that way. Now before I forget, I wanted to take one of these resin flowers and um, put them in the middle. So there it goes. It'll go like that. And then um you pretty you can pretty much start playing with this as you go. My battery just showed that it's about to die, so I don't want to get cut off making this video. Hurry up here and there we go. Just pick them up. Now if you drop them, if you try to drop them and it won't like go up, get down, all you do is twist it. I'll show you how. This probably caught a little bit of that um, dimensional magic that I just got on it. It'll just keep bending it until you can get rid of it. You see how I'm bending it? Come on. And all that means is that I have to clean my my picker. Cause I probably I got I got some glue on it and it's come on. See there it is. So all I'm gonna do is clean that and keep going. One goes over there. And 
And then, of course, you guys can get um, you can get just regular um, pearls, flatbacks, all that stuff. Pretty much, I I just go on eBay. I search by uh, buy now, and I look at the lowest with shipping. A lot of this stuff does come from um, overseas, but I've never had any problems. I've I've never had um, somebody not send me something, so I pretty much trust it really, really well. Um, what I like about these rhinestones compared to the Swarovski crystals is that you can get the dimensional magic over them, and if you buy the um, AB the alabaster, which is what I, what I bought. Okay, lingy they are. I bought the alabaster. Um, they're cheaper than Swarovski crystals, and you also get a really nice shine, especially with the dimensional magic. And then you guys can get as creative as you want to. This is the other one, one of the other ones that I had made. Um, like I said, you can always put more on top. Just to be sure, as you're gonna be gluing stuff on it, like I said, it will get um, oh, it will be re reinforced more and more. Um, I really love these little flowers that have them in, in um, some of my metal kits. You bend them a little bit, and then they're nice to put pearls in inside. See if you guys can see that. There it is. And then I'm just going to put a pearl right there in the center. Um, you can pull a cameo. Vintage buttons. I'm going to take a vintage button on this one. And I'm going to put it in the middle. I will be showing some of my final projects, too, to give you guys some ideas. I think I've, I'd, I'd already shown these to you. But flowers, butterflies, and, you know, it doesn't just have to be metals. You can also glue some charms, which I actually do. I do have many charms in here. You can make, like, artsy tiles with... Let's see, I got a cameo in here. I could probably glue this. I'll glue that down later on. Of this tiny little cameo. Just put some dimensional magic on the center. And I'm going to put this cameo. I think I actually want it to go like this. I'm going to put this cameo on. The middle and this could be used like like I said on um in a charm in an art I make on a dangle you name it I'm actually gonna put a key on one of these and let's do it on this one I think this one I'm gonna make a little bit of a collage of stuff so I'm just gonna put lay the dimensional magic And look how pretty that is. I'm gonna get a little closer. You can see that key in there. And I can always take my rub and buff and make that a different color. So, uh, if you guys have not seen the part one of uh, the video, it's, it shows you how I glued and made these tiles. Um, like I said, I'm also gonna link, I also linked up the. Um, the embellishment swap in my store so you guys can check some of this stuff out i hope that this was helpful and thank you so much for watching guys bye